Those down my cameras were amazing, thank you very much. Okay, You're welcome, okay. glad you enjoyed working with them. Well, Tim, let's head back to the studio. Hopefully, Meckle's back by now. That was a, a fun filler. See you later, Hoot Hoot. Yeah, this is a... I feel like it's like a more filler-ish chapter to like calm down with the story progression, which I don't mind. It's pretty chill. Meckle. Are you here? Still not here. What the hell? Here, Yan Yan. He's ready to roll. Yeah. Welcome back. Did you enjoy using the other characters? Characters, <laughs> cameras. It definitely didn't seem like it was his first time. Maybe he has the makings of a star. Nice job, Pikachu. Well, how was it? How was my acting? It was really good. Everyone was really impressed. I knew it. Man, I'm good at everything. Especially being full of yourself. Seems like... You there! Ugh, not her again. Did my darling Purgly come this way? Uh, no, it didn't. You haven't found it yet. No, this is all because of the absent-minded man. I should speak to his superiors. Is something the matter? President Graham, well, you see, my darling Purgly has gone missing in. Well, dear, that's not good. We don't have much time before rehearsal starts. Tim, do you think you could help us look? Of course. Well, I guess we don't have much choice now. Thank you. I'm looking forward to seeing your detective skills. God damn it. Where has Purgly gone? I'm not gonna bother with the case news. I guess I'll talk to everyone and see if they know where it is. You know where it is? I swear it's so moody. I wish Olga would keep an eye on it for once. It's her partner for crying out loud. So I think there's some frustration. This probably isn't the first time Purgly's watered off. Oh, the guy's gone. Shit. Uh, seems like Pearly doesn't get along too well with Chatot. They're always having a staring contest or something. Man, even filming them together is difficult, huh? Staring contest. You know anything? We're looking for Pearly, I swear. Who knows where it's gone to? Well, thanks, yeah. Let us know if you know anything. <laughs> Um, apparently Pergly is really picky about footage, always complains of another, and it tries to swap the cameras down with its tail. Sounds like it's pretty spoiled. Hi guys. Hi. So cute. We wandered out the door to the right, we should go check that way too, then it'll give us a chance to speak to people in the dressing room as well. Okay, hopefully no one else in there had like, little chat bubbles, um, tips for me. I know I'm not allowed in here, but I'm going in anyway! What's this? Where's that music coming from? Sounds beautiful. Here. What's in there? <gasps> Karina Mitchell. <gasps> Such a beautiful sound. Pikachu, come on. What's wrong, Cricketoon? Oh, Cricket! <laughs> oh. So sorry. Didn't mean to intrude. No, it's all right. Now this I game makes beautiful What's girls. That? I'm sorry. Are you going to be part of today's show? Yes. My name's Karina. Nice to meet you. Cricket. Attractive middle-aged musician. And this is my partner, Cricketoo. Cricketoo? Sorry, it seems to be in a bad mood. Pika! 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 <laughs> Aren't you a cute Pikachu, huh? Uh, don't let him fool you. Huh? He's bad. <laughs> He's a pervert. Alright, don't touch him. <laughs> hey, no need to be so defensive. I'm just a fan of Karina's. Let's be br friends, brother. There you go again with your chit-chat. Uh, you met Pergly- a uh, Pergly? Perugly or Pergly? Perugly? <laughs> I don't know. Before, that makes things easier. Did it come around here? It came by to kill time, and it shoved you out of the way and took your spot in the sofa for a nap. That's pretty selfish. Seems Perugly will take any spot that catches his fancy, never mind if someone is already there or not. Stealing a spot. About Karina? Karina's just plain gorgeous. You've got to introduce me. What? You can't let some random Pokemon get close to Karina. She's like a daughter to you. You're being overprotective. She is quite pretty. Yes. 
Are you a staff member of Maximum Music? Is a rehearsal about to start? No, we're actually looking for Perugly or whatever. Mr. Graham asked for our help. Well, I see. Perugly was... Per Perugly? I feel like Perugly sounds rude. So Perugly? Perugly? Was around here until just a little while ago. But... Yes, it wandered around and glared at me in Cricket Tune and then left. Wow, rude. Oh, are you interested in the violin? It was a gift from my grandmother back when I was little. I guess it's safe to assume you're a violinist then. Yes, although I'm very new to the scene. You really- What? What? You're new to the scene? You really played a beautiful tune. I'm looking forward to the show. Oh, thank you, but what's wrong? I'm not very good at, beginning, uh, at being in the spotlight. I think I'll be fine as long as I'm performing, but I can't imagine what it's going to be like speaking in front of cameras. I'm so nervous. But you'll have a crooked tune with me, right? I'm sure you'll be fine. It says quite right, young man. Uh, okay. Giving props to you. I was having Cricket Tune help me with tuning my violin. It can do that. Yes, it's very sensitive to sounds, and it can compose melodies on the spot using its arms. Wow, I'd love to see that. We'll be performing on a duet on the show. You can come watch if you like. Sensitive to sounds. Okay. Here's a sofa it's not on, I assume. Or is this sofa? Alright, we're leaving. Let's see. Next dressing room. Oh. What are you doing? Well, <laughs> Pikachu! Hello there, handsome. Oh, wait, it's just me. <laughs> I had a friend that, that used to be very into himself before, but then him and his wife had a daughter, and he, he's more spoiling his daughter now, so I guess that's a good improvement. Alright, guys. Tell me, have you seen this, this Pokemon that I really do not know what it looks like? We're looking for Purgly. Have you seen it anywhere? Um, it might be in the dressing room next door. Huh? Why? Apparently it's Purgly's daily routine to go around and make sure no young Pokemon stars get too full of themselves. I wonder what Purgly's like. They say Pokemon take after their partner, so I bet it got a temper. Huh? Have you found Purgly? Not yet. Sorry, I swear. Where could I have gone? This is nothing new, but I wish it'd stop. It's got big purple ears. Probably as big as my face, I'd say. Well, that big? Maybe it's a big Pokemon. Purple ears. I really don't know what it looks like. I assume the lady would have like a snubble, but that's what I keep thinking it is. But I'm pretty sure it's not it. Hey, have you guys seen Purgly? That's weird. All the static on the screen. Is everything alright? I've been seeing this weird static on the video view from the studio. Do you think it could be the cameras? It might be. Seems like the equipment here is fine, but either way, we need to fix it before the rehearsal. Interference. Partly. Now that you mention it, I don't think I've seen it today. It's usually one around the dressing rooms. Hero. partly has gone missing. Um, between you and me, Pergly's pretty vain Pokemon. It clenches it, it cinches its waist with its tail to make it lo itself look bigger and beefier. That's a strange habit. Well, it's a TV star. Even if it's a Pokemon, it just wants to look its best. Sounds like it's just stuck up to me. It makes itself look bigger. Okay. I'm checking the footage from studio cameras, but it seems like it's not working right. I'm getting a lot of static. You're right. What could be causing that? Is it on the satellite or something? Is it unusual that I walked using my hind legs? I'm more surprised they can stand on only one leg at a time. It never occurred to you. Well, yeah, if that figures, I guess. Uh, it says Pergoli is why things don't run on time around here. Hey now, come down. Don't worry, we'll find it for you. Uh, it says Hero's dream is to make programs that everyone can watch and enjoy as a family. It says it's going to do its best to help. That's good. I bet Hero's glad to have you, Hoot Hoot. Hero's dream. I don't know what tip that was for, but... Okay. I gotta get on the roof, guys. <laughs> oh! Mimikyu! Oh, Mimikyu, I love you so much. Oh, I believe Tyler got me a Mimikyu plushie. Hey, could you get out of the way? What's that? I'm trying to steal your. Uh, I'm trying to steal your chance to shine. Do you know this Pokemon Pikachu? No, this is Mimikyu. It's a star Pokemon scheduled to make an appearance on the show after Maximum Music. Apparently, I wonder what it wants with you. Since we do look alike, I think it's worried that I'll steal the spotlight from it. It doesn't need to worry about that. We're not even trying to be part of the. Hey, knock it off, Tim. Huh? What are you doing here, Mimikyu? I thought you were, t you were told to stay in the dressing room. Until it was your turn to be on the show. 
Hey, stop struggling. Tim, do you think you could tell your Pikachu to use its move to get Mimikyu to calm down? Huh? Well, uh, you say Pikachu can't use any moves. Hey, we need to tell everyone. Really? I didn't know Pokemon like that existed. Yeah, yeah, never heard that before. Who needs moves when I have my amazing intel intellect? Well, if that if it's the case, I guess it can't be helped. Come on, Mimikyu, back to the dressing room. If you don't behave, I'll have you banned from GNN. I guess that threat of a ban is enough to get it to calm down. I'll see you later, Tim. Oh. Alright. No, oh, yes. Mimikyu, huh? It was like a little typhoon. Yeah, and it was a star Pokemon. It was a star Pokemon, right? We didn't get a chance to ask it, but it might know something about Berkeley. Good point. We should ask about it later. Alright. Uh, someone's... That's an elevator. Dressing room. Whose dressing room is this? Oh, it's a fucking lady's dressing room. Jesus. Olga. What? Oh, you're so rude! My drawing's supposed to be so lonely! It must be just sweeping for my company. You think you could tell us more about Perkley? It might help us find it quicker. Uh, Perkley is just like a beautiful, fragile flower. It has a it, ha it has had a dignity about it since the day it was born, and it's loved by everyone. I see a Pokemon like a flower. Let me write that down. Be sure to make a note of everything I say. Pokemon is like a flower. It's rude, and it likes to make itself seem bigger. Hey, man. You got locked up again, thanks to us. That's because you decided to cause trouble in front of everyone. At this rate, you'll lose some Magnemite. Magnemite? You passed it on the hallway just now, huh? Is it going to be on the next show, too? Could be. It's probably trying to get the attention of important people, too. Man, you're a competitive one. Is this how all Pokemon stars are? Magnemite might be messing up the interferences. Ooh, who are you? you do a pretty good job, I'll give you that. But if you don't mind, no, 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 no. Look like under that cloth. Pikachu, you're gonna die if you do that. Ah! He's dead. <laughs> oh, that's a very unique Pikachu you have. Are you participating in the contest too? No, we're looking for a missing Pokemon. Do you think we can ask you a few questions? Oh, you mean the one Max, uh, one on Maximum Music? I haven't seen it today. Oh, okay. I think you'd be better off looking in another area. Nobody came this way. Oh, but this is something you noticed. Well, when we came to the dressing room, the door was unlocked. It was unlocked. Yes, you see, this is where the Pokemon who are going to appear on the show stay. The door is supposed to be locked when there's nobody around, so the Pokemon don't run off. So you think someone who came before you may have forgotten to lock it? Yeah, although there's no way to be sure. Oh, do you want to know Mawa's specialty? Huh? No, uh, it's really good at calligraphy. It holds the paintbrush in its jaws and swing it around with all its might. The result is artwork like I've never seen before. That sounds terrifying. I had heard the stories, but it really is handful, isn't it? You know about Mimikyu? Apparently it's a newbie Pokemon star. I've heard it appear, it'll appear anywhere there are cameras. It must be really desperate to get on TV. It's not often a Pokemon that will... A Pokemon... It's not often a Pokemon will have that kind of ambition. Who knows? It may become the next big thing. I believe so. Chomps with huge jaws. Hello. Hey there, waiting for your turn on stage? <laughs> no, that's the thing. We haven't seen it anywhere. Did it come by this way? No, but it came, huh? Oh well, let us know if it comes by. Uh, apparently it's also a participant in the contest. You don't want to lose. That's a spirit. I like Pokemon with a bit of fighting spirit. Okay, well, shit. Where's Magnemite? We, it said we passed it in the hallway. Is it hiding? Is it in the trash? I don't know. Where'd Pikachu go? He didn't follow me. Oh, he's so slow. <laughs> is it in here? Let's go to the rooftop. I'm assuming this is the rooftop. Oh, no it's not. What the hell? Oh, what's up? Pergly, I haven't seen it over here. Oh, great. Your great help. What is this? It looks like a trolley for something. I guess they're going to use it for a show. Oh, the violin! Right? Stan? What? What's down there? Is there anything over here before we go down there? Jesus, this place is huge. I don't see anything. Alright. Oh, 
Oh. Let's get back here. Guys, did you see anything? I don't really know much about it, but to be honest, we probably should speak to the show staff first. 